Another issue we've been covering involving fires and electric vehicles. Uh, now, thanks to money from E470, Aurora Fire Rescue is tooling up to effectively fight EV fires. Your reporter in Aurora, Michael Abeta, shows us how. Keeping a road like this safe requires a lot of partnerships, including with local first responders. That's why E470 wants to make sure Aurora Fire Rescue has all the tools they need to keep drivers safe. When it does ignite, it will burn extremely hot, extremely intense. When an electric car catches on fire, it's an especially dangerous situation for everyone including firefighters. There can be up to 35, maybe even 40 different types of gases that come off of these, and all of them are very toxic to the respiratory system for the firefighters and to the bystanders that would be standing around these vehicles. So fighting them is tricky and sometimes not possible, like in the case of this deadly crash earlier this year. A Tesla caught fire after a collision, but all Aurora Fire could do was let it burn out. That didn't really sit well with them, so they bought one special blanket they can use to help them contain an electric vehicle fire if they ever have one again. Recognizing that is a benefit to the citizens in the city of Aurora. But Aurora is Colorado's third largest city, and the blanket can only be used once. So they decided to apply for money to get more. We really strive to have a safe roadway, and so I think it's very important that the first responders are equipped. E470 Safety Foundation has an annual grant they give out to the community. This year, they gave Aurora Fire Rescue $2,500 to buy more EV blankets. That, added to some already allocated funds, means AFR will be able to buy five more blankets, or one for each battalion chief. It's the best thing for the citizens. If there ever were an EV fire on E470 in Aurora, AFR would respond, and they say that this will help keep citizens safe everywhere, in the city and on the tollway. We don't have a water supply on E470. This is going to allow us to put them over the top of the car, delay that chemical reaction, get the fire apparatus on scene and be able to apply water to it and rapidly cool it down. E470 says all the money they give out is raised. None of it comes from tolls. Michael Aveta covering Colorado first. Michael is one of three reporters covering Aurora for you. You can send him your tip through CBSColorado.com. You can also give him a call on our tips line 303-863-TIPS or send him an email at yourreporter at CBS.com.